Now on to Romania. This is Alexandra Ambrush. So she was in this final last year. She also handled a pointer. And she's chosen to handle a pointer this year. And she's 15. She's 14, actually. I know the screen says 15. We're just slightly out. And she has three dogs at home. She is the Dachshund and Shiba Inu. She's been competing as a junior handler for four years. She's in eighth grade of college. And she enjoys studying about the German language. She also likes maths and physics. She'd like to be a vet when she grows up. In her spare time, she loves to snowboard and play basketball. So representing Romania, that's Alexandra Ambrish. So on the table now is the representative from Slovakia, Daniela Nematova. So she's 17, and this is her first time competing here at Crufts in this international final. She's chosen to handle a Petit Basset Griffon Vondion. And at home, she has three dogs, two small dogs, and one Brazilian Terrier. She started showing in 2017 when she was 10 years old. She was introduced to shows by her father's long-term friend who breeds and shows American Staffordshire Terriers. And she talked her into trust trying it and giving it a go. And then she became fully committed to shows and learning about the dog community. She also competes in obedience. Although she's not at a professional level right now, she says, but she's getting ready for it. She's in third grade at high school. And her favorite subjects are chemistry and biology. She also wants to be a marine biologist or work in a laboratory as a chemist. She also loves cars and motorsport and is a big fan of Formula One. So that's from Slovakia, Daniela Nematova. So on to Slovenia. Meet Nikita Rehak Frisch. This is Nikita's first time in this final at Crufts. And she has seven dogs at home, all have a knees. But she requested an American Cocker Spaniel to show in this competition. And this is the one that she has been given and she was met this morning just like all the other handlers met their new dogs just this morning at half past seven we're so grateful to all the dog lenders who have come to the show today some of them might be showing on other days some might not be showing at all and have come all the way to birmingham to bring their dogs for our handlers it's, we are so thankful for them so nikita she's loved dogs since she was a little girl she started showing when she was 11. She's got two cats and a hamster at home. And she's in the first year of vet school. She loves studying foreign languages, especially the English language. And perhaps she can 
teach me a thing or two about how to pronounce her name correctly, but I think I got there in the end. She'd love to be a dog groomer and a dog handler. And she loves riding horses, playing piano and boxing. That's the representative from Slovenia, Nikita Rehark Frisch. So moving on to South Africa. We meet Anita Skuman. She was here last year and she competed with a Boston Terrier. She's gone for a different breed and it's a golden retriever. We've only got one golden retriever competing in this final this year. And funnily enough, we, the dog that's been lent, I think is from Croatia. <laughs> so it's not a British dog. <laughs> But we're so grateful to the lovely dog lender to bring the golden retriever because there's 500 golden retrievers entered today and it was very difficult to get one to come and compete in this final. But this is Anita and she's been handling dogs since she was two years old. And she was in fancy dress with, when she handled her Rottweiler. But she started child handling when she was six years old at an open show. And then when she was eight, she started showing at championship level. She's got other pets at home, a cat and a Jack Russell. She's in year three in her school, gonna be in year four soon. She loves studying English at school. It's her second language. Obviously she's African speaking and she's a language she'd like to learn for the future. That's Anita Schumann from South Africa. <laughs> On to Spain. This is Adriana Sanchez Natividad. She's 15 years old, and this is her first time in the Crofts Junior Hand of the Year final. And she has four dogs at home, two standard poodles, one miniature poodle, and one dachshund. So she's handling a miniature poodle here. We're very grateful to our poodle dog lenders because there's so much work to put into getting a dog, a breed of this breed, presented for this final. We're really, really grateful for the lending of all these beautiful poodles. So Adriana has been showing dogs for five years because her father is a breeder and a professional handler. She loves to go horse riding as well. She goes to public school and high school she loves art. She says she'd like to continue the work of her father and work with dogs. And she likes to go to the gym and have fun with her friends. So there is the representative from Spain, Adriana Sanchez Natividad. Just five handlers left with 22 minutes to go. So this is Sweden. Sweden is represented by Nelly Podlinski. 
Nelly is 18 years old. This is her first time in the International Junior Handling Final. She has three dogs at home. Two that are Bernese Mountain Dogs and one Shetland Sheepdog. She says when her family started showing, she wanted to be part of the fun too. So she started to compete in child with dog competitions. And then she found out there was junior handling instead. And so there was nothing else, there's more she wanted to do. She started handling in competitions at 11. She trains agility with her Sheltie and she's even gone to a few competitions. They've also got a cat. But she says here, there's not, much, not many activities you can do with a cat. <laughs> this is why we have dogs. She's attending the second of three years of uh, Swedish school and she's studying a media program with focus on photography and film. She's another one that says she loves traveling. Well, she's traveled a long way from Sweden and it's lovely to see her. Welcome 18-year-old Nelly Podlinski from Sweden. And here on the table is the representative of Switzerland. This is Nora Sorter. She's the youngest competitor in this year's final. She's just 11 years old. I haven't seen her anything but smile since she got here. I think she's really enjoying herself. She's handling a black miniature schnauzer. So at home, she has far five barbets. And she said that she started becoming involved in dog showing three years ago. She's fascinated of animals in general and especially dogs. She's seen her mother train in the ring and she said she'd really like to do the same. So it's brilliant that she's here. She also has three rabbits and two chickens. Again, she says here, they are like friends to her, but she doesn't do any sports with them. <laughs> I don't think you probably do much sports with rabbits and chickens. So she's in fifth grade at primary school, and her favorite subjects are German and PE. And she'd like to become a kindergarten teacher and educate little children in how to treat animals. Congratulations, and it's nice to see you. The youngest competitor from Switzerland, Nora Suter. So we welcome Ukraine, Katerina Velichenko, and she's 18 years old and handling this whippet. This is her first time in the International Junior Handling Final. And at home, she has two miniature schnauzers and a long coat chihuahua. She's been involved in dog handling from a young age. Because she says her mother is a breeder of German Shepherds, and so she used to go to the dog shows with her. She's in the first year of university, uh, studying political geography. And she's interested in analyzing the political problems of different countries around the world. And we really enjoyed her speech at the afternoon welcome celebration yesterday. She says that she absolutely loves dog handling and dog shows, and she says that's never going to leave her life. She also loves to play table tennis. Hmm, I might have to have a match with her sometime. And she loves to spend time with dogs and studying.
representing the Ukraine, Katerina Velichenko. So just two to go, and now we see the representative from the United Kingdom. This is 15-year-old Paige Hughes. This is her first time in the International Junior Handling Final. So she definitely wins the award for having the most dogs at home. So she has 17 dogs that live at home, 17 Siberian Huskies, no less, and one Dalmatian. She started showing dogs at the age of six, and she started training at the age of five with the help of her mum in the back garden. With her Siberian Huskies, she participates in rallies and treks and covering a certain amount of miles in forests and mountains, and they train them in a, their local forest, and the Dalmatian joins the, the pack for the fitness. She's in year 11 doing her GCSEs at secondary school. Her favorite subjects at school are PE and biology. She likes learning about the human body and doing different sports. She wants to do animal care or even be a dog handler in the police force. Handling the border collie, that's Paige Hughes from the United Kingdom. And here now representing the USA. Here is Octavia Stenson handling a Hungarian Vizsla. Octavia is 19 years old and this is her first time in this international final. At home, she has three dogs, two Norwegian Buhuns and a Pembroke Welsh Corgi. She started showing nine years ago when she got her first Norwegian Buhund. She loved it and she just basically carried on. She enjoys teaching dog tricks in her spare time. And she's currently a freshman in college. She'd like to stay active in dog shows and possibly become a professional handler. She said she's really focused on her studies. Uh, she's majoring in Mandarin in school. She says she's loving learning a new language and the challenges that come with it. She enjoys watching movies and spending time outdoors. All these handlers keeping so calm and collected and being so kind and gentle with these dogs that they, they only met this morning. Well done to the USA, Octavia Stenson. So we have 12 minutes left. What will our judge decide to do? He's judged them all individually. Perhaps we'll see them go out and back one more time. For those of you who have just come into the arena and joined us this morning, where have you been? We've been here since 8.30 and watching this amazing competition, the Joe Cartilage Memorial International Junior Handling Final. All of these handlers are champions in their own countries. And the judge is judging the handler 
on their presentation and skill and bond and style that they have with their dog. These dogs do not belong to these handlers. All of the handlers are under the age of 19. All of the handlers only met these dogs this morning. And I highly commend them all for doing such an amazing job in the ring here today. We have a lovely team of helpers. We've got a fantastic ring stewarding team as well. We've got Lisa Moyer, Caitlin Forbes, Faye Matthews, and Min Withyman, all former junior handlers in this country. We're gonna see them move again. So come on, let's warm up our hands, please, and say <laughs> welcome to Australia, Diana Mussolino. This is Belgium, handled by Laura DeVos. And Bulgaria. This is Samuel Bonin. Canada, Laurence Gigard. From the Czech Republic, Sara Malinova. Representing Denmark, Sarah DeAngelis. From Estonia, Gerda Wunsch. From Finland, Jonas Sotala. Representing France, it's Sarah Duchelieu. That Labrador still wagging. It's Germany, Alexandra Yunov. <laughs> Representing Greece, Effie Sezenia. From Hungary, Greta Straub. And representing Iceland, Freya Grumin Stotia. From Ireland, Molly Mullen. <laughs> From
from Israel, Liri Sokolovsky. The lady in red, it's Chatia de Bella from Italy. From Japan, Yuha Tamura. From Latvia, this is Alice Semeta. Representing Lithuania, Dia Maximovic Chuta. From Malta, Mariah Manicaro. Monaco, and we are now on to the Netherlands, Sole Haukushoven. Monaco was represented in the red by Nicole Zaza. From New Zealand, it's Jacob Ashwell. From Norway, it's Mimi in Dina Nilsson. <laughs> Representing Poland, Zosia Raboy. Representing Portugal, it's Maria Flores Ribeiro. <laughs> and Romania, Alexandra Ambrush. Slovakia is a Daniela Nebatova. And Slovenia, Nikita Rehak Frisch. We've got a full main ring program lined up for the rest of the day. It's now two minutes to 10, and this is South Africa, Anita Schumann. Representing Spain, Adriana Sanchez Natividad.
Sweden is Nelly Podlinski. Switzerland, we have Nora Sorter. <laughs> Representing Ukraine, Katerina Velichenko. <laughs> Representing the United Kingdom, it's Paige Hughes. <laughs> and from the USA, the Hungarian visual with Octavia Stenson. So what happens now, our judge is going to liaise with our fabulous steward, Faye Matthews, also a former junior handler. In fact, she won the breeders' competition here with her Pomeranian, team of Pomeranians last year. And they're going to take a note of his shortlist. He's going to mentally pick out which ones he would like to see in the final. But all of these handlers we will see in this main arena later on tonight, which is going to be in this arena from 20 past 6 to 20 to 7, so 6.20. Our dog owners and hand, our dog owners will need to be down in the collecting ring by 5 o'clock, please, in the collecting ring by 5 o'clock with your dogs in the collecting ring and the handlers too, please, to return to the collecting ring at 5 o'clock. And then we will see all of these 36 competitors come into the ring and then we will reveal the shortlist. I don't know how many Roni's going to pick. He might pick eight, he might pick nine, he might pick 10. That's usually around the number. And we won't know until this evening. And then he will judge those 10 again and pick one, two, and three. So a winner, a runner-up, and third place. He's clapping his hands. Well done to our judge, Mr. Roni Dudines. Think you did a fabulous job. Very experienced judge. Big round of applause to all of our dogs and our young handlers. Well done. You can relax now, guys. And if Min Withy Moon could lead out the handlers from that exit, please. You're going to go all the way round.